Hello, my name is Rohini Sahasrabuddhe and I work in the KEM hospital as a transplant coordinator. I'd like to share a little bit about the role of the Zonal Transplant Coordination Center or ZTCC Pune as it's called. So the Zonal Transplant Coordination Center Pune mooted by the Directorate of Health Services Maharashtra started in 2004 under the chairmanship of Air Marshal retired Shashi Ramdas. Its main function is to oversee and ensure equitable, smooth and unbiased distribution of deceased donor organs in the city. The ZTCC also maintains and regularly updates a separate centralized waiting list of organ recipients for kidneys, liver, pancreas, heart, small bowels and hand transplants. Uh, by operating an automatic grading and point system. This helps to ensure that patients receive organs from a donor according to priority. The system is borrowed from the West and ascribes point based on certain medical conditions to the waitlisted recipients who do not have a family member to donate organs. By doing so, it ensures that no organ pledged by the family of the deceased donor or the brain dead donor goes waste and all organs are used. So when typically when a comatose patient due to maybe a road traffic accident, an IC bleed or an intracranial bleed or stroke is admitted in a hospital's ICU, uh, they must necessarily be certified and confirmed brain dead twice through various brainstem death tests by a government accredited brain death committee uh, uh, all the members are accredited by the by the government of different hospitals before they can be declared brain death the grief counselor or the transplant coordinator as the case may be approaches the family of the potential deceased donor to consider organ donation only after confirmation of brain death. After the family consents to organ donation, the hospital transplant coordinator informs the ZTCC central coordinator. She in turn alerts the various coordinators of potential recipient hospitals to notify their and prepare their waitlisted patients for various procedural steps to receive the organ. So the ZTCC also facilitates multi-organ transplants through the central coordinator teaming up with the police department to create green corridors to ensure safe, smooth and quick transportation of organs from the do donor hospital to various cities. The coordination of various transplant teams to retrieve and harvest organs is also facilitated by the ZTCC and the hospital coordinators. The most recent development is the formation of the National Organ and Tissue Transplant Organization or the NOTO as it's called to facilitate interstate deceased uh, donor transplants. This body maintains a central registry of not only the waitlisted patients but also the outcome of such transplants. I must say that this humongous task of successfully transplanting registered waitlisted recipients has become much easier today through the coordinated efforts of all these agencies.